All right, welcome to Loser Semis. We're back to best two out of three for this match right here. It's going to be oh, Cincy versus Mr. L. Mr. L doing a fantastic, fantastic run today in order to make it all the way to Loser Semis. But now he has to face one of the one of the demons here in bracket, Sinji, who this is his first offline event. This is his uh, first offline? First offline event. Yeah, I can hear you, bud. Loud and clear. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Like, do this? Yes. Okay. Yes. Just wanted to make sure. <laughs> okay, so. I'm um, just kidding. I can't hear anything you're saying. I don't worry. And, but anyways, um, L's run, right? Holy moly. He went through, he went through blank, went through gen. I don't know what. He went through blank again? Yeah. Oh my god, twice? Yep, that's who we beat in order to get into our uh, loser semis. Talk about crack. And I don't think it's crack right there. That's that crazy strong for absolutely no reason. Yeah, I mean, so Mr. L took out one of the NYC uh, sort of monsters who showed up today. But here's the other one. And this yeah. time around, Sin it's going to be Sinji. And that means that, you know, against uh, Jen, honestly, that set was super, super close. And close. a great one to watch. Uh, but Mr. L definitely had that experience against Palu. Yeah, I, mean, I don't know how much match experience he has against the Pac-Man likes him. Well, I know he's in grunt. Quid's in grunt also, so I don't know if Quid messed around with the Pac-Man when these two have played. I'm, I'm certain these two have played a lot of them. That's just my guess. But, um... I don't know. Oh, what? <laughs> so, I don't, I don't that, know. Wow. Uh, <laughs> tac tactical. I He's 100% tactical. Oh, he was what? expecting to get pushed by the water. I, okay, you know what? I I'm, I'm, I started off joking, but I think that by the end of that, the way he reacted with a forward air, I think he was anticipating it. So I'm going to take back any sort of doubts I had about matchup experience. I think Mr. L does kind of know what he's doing in this match. Holy moly. That's apparently sort of stingy because that, that, that cast is just so, it's so ready. He was ready for the quick attack. Uh, what? Doing all right there, buddy. I am just shocked. <laughs> He, I mean, he used the trampoline to get out of the loop. I mean, you're more shocked than Sinji was. I mean, Sinji looked like it's just another day at the office. Yeah. Oh my! I just have never seen that before. What? Oh, you're gonna see. You're gonna have uh, plenty of treats then, because Sinji, the way he utilizes every single tool in Pac-Man's kit, nah, he just stands there. He, oh, that's. Are you kidding? That was hilarious. And he makes it back. I knew he was going to make it back with no problem. Like, it, it's Pikachu. Come on. I didn't. That looked like a bunch of misinputted upbeats. Yeah, so you saw him. You doubted the Pikachu quick attack. You, you doubted how good Sakura made that move. All right. Now we are getting to the sort of very interesting part of the matchup, which is Sinji's looking for the kill right now. That means he's probably looking for Apple, he's looking for Key, those sorts of things. He does not want to go in and actually engage with a Pikachu, even if he does have a lead like this. Never mind, he's going to run into his face and grab. <laughs> he's done. Uh, you have to remember it. You always have to remember. That is just so sneaky. It's so fast. You remember, it has to be in your brain. The, uh, the projectile that Sinji has charged up with his neutral beam. Because whatever it is, that is going to be part of his game plan. If, he's, if it's an orange, he has a plan with that orange. If it's a bell, he has a plan with the bell. And so you have to anticipate that, or else he's going to control the entire game. I think he's a very slippery character himself. As it also to control the game. But uh, it's Pac-Man. And having the high beam down kind of just denies Pikachu the main neutral tool, you know, the T-Jolt. And then you can see Sinji, like, again, all these other teams control the game. It makes me wonder as, like, who really has the edge in this match of, like, character wise? It's really hard to say. And, I mean, I honestly, I should ask Sinji about it later. But it's, it's the sort of thing where it doesn't matter what the character matchup is really like because Sinji always has a plan. For, especially against the top tiers who he has to fight regularly. Yeah. He knows what he needs to do, and he's just going to do that. Mm -hmm. At that point, he knew, okay, I need to get the bell kill. I saw him jumping a lot. So bell is going to be the answer. It's, 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 it doesn't... There are very few characters, I think, where Sinji's like, I have no idea what I can do against them. Even characters who do well against Pac-Man, which I assume Pikachu does pretty I well against Pac-Man. I feel like a lot of characters are thinking that. I think they're thinking, I don't know what I'm doing with Pac-Man. It's like it's on the opposite side. And since he's like, oh, they don't know what they're doing? Okay. Regular game plan. No nothing too special. 
Let's go see what the habits are, and then bada boom. Bell, a smash, and that's all yeah. she wrote. But the thing is, Shinji's not, he's not reliant on gimmicks. It's not like he's like, I need my opponent to not know how to play against Pac-Man. I mean, that F-Smash is kind of feels like a gimmick. I'm not going to lie. Which one? The, the, the F-Smash. The forward smash? That forward smash is way too strong. <laughs> it feels like a gimmick from how, my, how early it kills you sometimes. Okay, you actually, you mentioned how Hydra denies Bob. That's silly. Um, Hydra denies T-Jolt before, but the other thing that can deny T-Jolt is pac in side beat. Because if the projectile connects with it, the pellet will drop, and Shinji can also heal off of it. It will not only block the hit, but then he can heal. And it's something he will absolutely do. Oh, F-Smash is barely missing right I don't there. think he would, he, he didn't recognize right that the pellet no, was going to hit. I think he needed to charge it just a little bit more in order to get the kill. I think he knew it wasn't going to kill otherwise. So we got still, a little I bit still creep. take creep stage with me with the to any day of the week. Oh, good what job. The the <laughs> oh, sure, I guess. Yeah, I think Sinju was shocked at that too. L, even though he put on the. Ooh, nice catch. Alright, uh, also some signs of life and the tail getting stopped by Sin. Yeah, that super rummer on the side be coming out super good for Sinji. And it sucks as L had the right read too, but uh, that's the wrong part. He was basically with it all there. I think he is on deck. He is on deck. Not there it is. Nice yeah. catch. <laughs> <laughs> nice catch is what I would say. <laughs> uh, he didn't get a key to his face. <laughs> That's like you know when you know someone's like, hey, like you know, like hey, can you give me the keys? And they toss it at you, and it goes in your eyeball. That's what that was. Wait, we need the Eminem meme of him just like throwing the thing. But it's just Holy moly! Uh. This is mad. Forty-five percent off. Of you straight galactic. Still going. 63 for that one interaction. Oh man, who said all Pac Man does his own? You know how to fight? Oh, I. Oh, Pac Man does not. That is not the only thing Pac Man can do. He is a, like a trap character. He's, his zoning is like reliant on setup. That was good to see. I, I forgot Down Throw Thunder was a thing. Did he just eat another, like, super armor through the thunder again? I don't even know if that thunder hit. I know L's fine. I thought I saw him electrify from it. And, all right. Nice. Yeah, that's the sort of thing where eventually Pikachu will get you to the point where I'll throw will kill. And at that point, it's just only a matter of time, honestly. <laughs> How hard can you keep the rat out of, out of your hair? Oh, I seem to be doing a really good job at that. They get to find it super hard to get through the wall. Oh, actually, we had Mr. L absorb the uh, pellet right there. Uh, yeah, stealing his treats. I uh, do like shitty rats. <laughs> Beats a rat. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's just, that's, oh my god! That was, and you notice, he throws it down and immediately starts to go to cover. Uh, he super armor through that like six times. Jesus Christ, it just doesn't matter. And I thought, I do think Thunder is strong enough to break super armor too. Uh, no, it is super armor, so that's not heavy armor. Oh, I lied. Yeah, so it's is not. Is super armor at the start of the game? What? Where is I think it's once he eats the pellet. Uh, that makes a lot of sense. It's, it's not necessarily that wide. Like, it's not like there's a huge amount of super armor on it, but Sinji is timing is really perfect right now. And nice. this game's even. It is a lot even. It's such a, it's such a better game than this game, than the last game. And I feel like it's because, you know, lack of platforms, more of a neutral stage, a lot less, like, less cover for Pac-Man. And more room to, like, play neutral, more room to, like, people to, like, you know, two my team jewels, I can get in, I can play my neutral the way I want to. Yeah, I mean, I think another part of it is the advantage stage. Mr. L, especially on that stock, too. He killed uh, Sinji a lot earlier than before. Like, I mean, first stock was like, well, 180 with an up throw, then he actually managed to seal the deal pretty early. And now we have a completely dead even game between these two. It is worth also mentioning Brock is at 250. I don't necessarily think we're going to be seeing a timeout, but oh. if these two slow it down, the time may become a, a factor. Like, Mr. L has to approach. Oh my god, just remember this. That's not a three, not that five. Oh, yeah. So we this is, is L's tournament life right now. Will he be staying alive? Good job right there, going for the thunder on the oh later side of it. The side piece coming in, knocking people That's to the other hand. side. God, that should have been a death. Throws him into it. Holy moly! Apple is in hand. Oh, did not re-grab really the apple. Covering. 
trying to snipe with the F tilt. You out of here? What is gonna happen in the back? Yeah. What? Did you see it? It slid the right in the water. Got sent out by the hydrant. <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> that was. Have you ever seen? You seen Finding Nemo, right? Of course. You remember when they enter into the the Gulf Stream? Oh my God! Shoom, that's what just happened. <laughs> out of this, son. <gasps> uh.